55. Now, if this TV show is actually growing pains, we'd say it's a very special episode this morning. <laughs> Wilson is talking about something that impacts everyone, it feels like, breast cancer. And again, this year, WCCV is teaming up with Susan G. Komen and Carowinds. Good morning to you, buddy. Good morning, everybody from wild and wonderful Carowinds at five something in the morning. Wait a morning. minute, hey, How are you guys, today? we're we're in the we're yeah. in the pink box. We got the pink thing back here. You can see pink behind I'm you. I'm wearing the pink tie, I and where's your necklace. where's the pink? Well, dude, I don't own any pink. All, only pink stuff I had are like hockey jerseys. He's not wearing that. It's too hot for that. Why are you calling me out on not wearing the pink, Derek? Come on, dude. Well, because we went through all the, the, the people downstairs, came up with the pink box and the pink thing. Management, I know. Yeah. Disappointing. You should have bought something. Well, okay, okay, okay. I only own one thing of clothing now that is actually pink. <laughs> I, I will never doubt you again. Boy, do you have nice ankles, my friend. <laughs> Those are nice. You know what? You behave yourself, young lady. <laughs> Did he shave? He they may don't have. seem as. Harry. <laughs> I'm glad he's wearing clean socks. We would have saw holes this early in the That morning. would have been bad, yeah. Oof. 557, his whites are extra white, <laughs> thanks to his wife. Well, heavy rains have caused major flooding issues across our area. But after the water went away, people living in a Chester apartment complex say their problems Now, back to you. 748 the time, so Wilson's live. Can we just, uh, Holly, can we just punch him up? <laughs> Gosh, you're cute. With glasses. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Can that bunny speak? <laughs> the boss said to wear something pink. <laughs> um, so here's what's happened. Park is here from Susan G. Coleman, and they ordered me, because, you know, we're giving out the pink ducks here, Karen. They ordered me uh, a pink duck suit. I think you got the order messed up, Park. <laughs> Sorry about that. Yeah, you definitely wore pink. I did. Well, uh, you know. Listen, we're hanging out here this morning. Uh, Elizabeth Ann was just on talking about her mom is a great thing. And we're going to talk to her. She wants to talk about how you can sign up and do all this good stuff and everything. But I said, hey, can you say a line from the movie that this is from? And she looks at me, all 14 years old of her, and she goes... You're a pink nightmare. Well, yeah, but you didn't even know what the movie was. What's no, the movie? I have no idea. You have no idea what this is from? No idea. If I said Ralphie, would that mean anything? No. If I said, you'll shoot your eye out, kid, would that mean anything? No. Do you celebrate Christmas? Yes. Come on! You haven't seen the Christmas story? I have, now that you mention it, okay. but I don't really... You don't remember the pink... How can people sign up for your thing? Um, go to comancharlotte.org, and we would love for you to join our team, Mary Brian's Bosom Buddies, Brian with the Y. The race is October 5th at Marshall Park, and we look forward to having you join us. You'll shoot your eye out, kid. Nothing. Get out of here with these kids ruining the show. How do you not know Christmas story? And they ordered the wrong suit. It's supposed to be a pink rab duck. Give me a rabbit suit here. I am a pink nightmare, aren't I? How you doing? Listen, Park is here. You're a Susan G. Coleman. Uh, man, partner, we've partnered up with Carowinds. You've partnered up with, with, with Carowinds. It's a great thing. People, you know, know this. Susan G. Coleman, a lot of these items they have here for Sarah Carowinds, a uh, portion of the proceeds go into Susan G. Coleman. You guys are really active here locally, aren't you? We definitely are. We definitely are, Wilson. We spend uh, a lot of our time and effort uh, trying to deliver the mission of Susan G. Coleman here locally. Uh, a lot of the, all the funds that are raised here go directly towards our mission. 75% uh, 70, of that money stays right here uh, to help under, underinsured and uninsured women here how many times have you been interviewed by somebody in a bunny suit this makes six awesome there you go he's good i like him uh i'm almost as tall as you with the ears here so if people want to get more involved with susan g coma what should they do there are a lot of different opportunities. The first thing I would encourage you to do is to visit our website, as, uh, Mary, as she just mentioned, yeah. comacharlotte.org. Right. Also, you've got an opportunity to come to Carowinds for the Cure, yeah. uh, buy a pink duck, yeah. which you guys know all about here. Uh, maybe Wilson will have his pink rabbit suit on. Maybe he won't. Uh, and then, obviously, uh, the Race for the Cure is October the 5th uh, yeah. in Uptown Charlotte. Uh, it's a huge, great event. So uh, it's a lot of fun for a very serious disease. Yeah. Now, you know, and, and I do like this. It is very serious. We had, the, you know, uh, Elizabeth Ann's mom on, and it is serious. We're going to some more survivors coming up here in just a little bit. I'm wearing, uh, and really, I mean, seriously, besides all the holidays, they're the only people that I would be wearing a pink bunny suit for. You'll shoot your eye out, kid. I am a pink nightmare. We've got a whole lot more coming up from Carowinds. Weather, traffic, a lot of fun in the studio. Keep it right here on Rising, everybody.